Question 16. What is promoted property in BizTalk server? Answer. The promotion of prompted fields, properties is done in the message context by a pipeline called receive pipeline at the time when a message is received on a port. This task is performed by disassembler pipeline component XML or a flat file disassembler. In addition to it, custom pipeline component could also be performing it. Question 17. Describe the purpose of BAM in BizTalk server. Answer. Purpose of deriving up-to-date metrics and key performance indicators from the BAM databases, business integration tools are used. The forecasting of process trends by users and monitoring processes in real-time scenarios is done by using BI tools. Users get alerts for situations which need their intervention for preventing undesirable outcome for encouraging beneficial results, a mechanism is provided by BAM. Question 18. What is BAM in BizTalk server? Answer. Business data and process milestones are captured by Business Activity Monitoring, BAM, which is a module in BizTalk. Business decisions makers are allowed by BAM for gaining insight for their in-flight process. Question 19. How to use the message types? Answer. Right-click messages in the orchestration view tab to create a new message. You have four choices for the message type property. Expand multi-part message types and then choose create new multi-part message type. Name your multi-part message type then expand it so you can see its message part underscore one member. This talk suggested name. Set the message body part property to true so that it acts just like a regular message. Question 20. How to change the message type? Answer. Before jumping in to do as the error message suggests, let's think for a moment about what that entails. Inspect every receive and send shape to determine if it uses a message variable that's associated with the schema you want to change. It's not a good practice to create a single orchestration with so many receive, send shapes. Delete port connections, once you find all the receive, send shapes. Change the message variable so that the message type property is set to the new schema and then reassociate the message variable with each receive, send shape. Find all the port types that are associated with the ports you disconnected from receive, send shapes and reset their operations message type properties. Use a multi-part message type to wrap the underlying schema. It's flexible and saves time in the long run. Question 21. What is message type in BizTalk server? Answer. Messages in BizTalk are data, and each message must be of a selected message type. Email, documents, info path forms, large binary files, SQL records, flat files, and anything XML can be processed as messages. BizTalk is all about messages and message-oriented programming. The most common message type in BizTalk is a schema. Question 22. What BizTalk enables for companies? Answer. BizTalk enables companies to integrate and manage business processes by exchanging business documents between business applications within or across organizational boundaries. Question 23. On what BizTalk Server 2000 is based? Answer. BizTalk Server 2000 is based on the BizTalk framework. It provides the infrastructure and tools to enable B2B e-commerce and process integration. Question 24. What BizTalk provides? Answer. BizTalk provides cost savings when used in internal IT projects and can be used in externally focused solutions too. Question 25. Does BizTalk framework is an open framework? Answer. The BizTalk framework is an open framework for B2B exchange. It is implemented across all major platforms and most major B2B products. Question 26. What is BizTalk Framework? Answer. The BizTalk Framework is a set of guidelines for driving the consistent adoption of XML to enable e-commerce and application integration. It is initiated by Microsoft and supported by a wide range of organizations. Question 27. What is the difference between a message assignment shape and an expression shape? Answer. A message assignment shape is used to create a new message and assign values to it. A expression shape is used to assign values to variables and also write if conditions. Question 28. What is the difference between distinguished field and promoted property? Answer. Promoted properties can be accessed in orchestrations, ports, pipelines, schemas. They use server resources. Distinguished fields are lightweight and can be accessed only in orchestrations. Question 29. 
What is correlation in context of Bistock server? Answer, an orchestration can have more than one instance running simultaneously. Even though each of those multiple instances perform the same action, it does it on different data contained within a message. Correlation is a process of associating an incoming message with the appropriate instance of an orchestration. Question 30. What is Bistock orchestration's dehydration and rehydration? Answer, dehydration, when an orchestration has been idle for a while, the orchestration engine will save the state information of the instance and free up memory resources. Rehydration, when a message is received, or else when a timeout has expired, the orchestration engine can be automatically triggered to rehydrate the instance, it is at this point that the orchestration engine loads the saved instance of the orchestration into memory, restores the state, and runs its from the point it left off.